Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'll be unboxing a fountain pen from Helix. Oxford. So she's got a medium nib. I really like fountain pens and I'm a favourite fountain pen. So let's open this up. Yeah, but that's some hard back, isn't it? Alright. So, it's, it's in this packet. What this? That's nice. So, let's take it out. And it's, I fucking feel how good the quality is. Oh, yeah, boy. Inside of it, but that is that is some prestige. It's like I can feel it's metal. It feels really nice in my hands. Like you can try and focus it. Mm, I don't think it's gonna focus. Like that looks nice. Look at the quality as well. It looks nice. Let's open it up again and uh, put an ink cartridge in it. So, open up from here. Okay, so it takes this type of ink cartridge. This is a blue ink, but I have some black ink because I like black ink because it's from school. We're going to be using black ink. So, 50 in here, JMC. Basically, something I think they they can fit. Um. So, it's all bands to metal barrel and everything. Uh, so I flip it. Pretty sure I just put it in here. Have to just pop it in. This one just feels a bit better, but I don't know. Can't like you guys can see that. I'm supposed to put it in there. So try forcing it. Okay, yeah, itching. Okay, I think it works. Um, it's working. We do have another. Blue ink, it should never be open, but I guess we got an extra blue ink coverage. Yeah, but this feels good. Um, take a feels good. Um, let's get some paper and um, check out the quality here. Got some paper here. If it starts working, I haven't started working yet. We're gonna have to wait a bit. So, guys, um, whilst this is uh, like the ink's going down on it, I'll just show you my other one that I have. So, I'm just gonna try and keep it down. Like that, I'll just put it there. Make sure it doesn't hold up. Alright, so this is my big one. It's not, it's not as, still pretty good. Um, I'll just put this in there for the thing under me and put it back. Alright, yeah, so it's pretty good quality as well. Let's see. Now, right, hello here. It's gonna be upside down for you, but still, weird. I really like this pen because I just like fountain pens in general. It's my favorite. So let's just check if the fountain pen over here is working. It still isn't working. 
I'm gonna try the blue ink and then check if it works. This should be working, but let's try a blue one. Maybe like that ink doesn't work. But that's no problem. I'm just changing the ink. I mean the ink. Plus it went down. It's not writing though. Let's try this one. Okay, maybe I have to push it in more. Wait, let's take this out. Maybe I have to push this one in more. No, oh, let's just try the blue one. Alright guys, it's started to work. I'll put, put it back in the black one. It's started to work and show you. So, let me just put this back in. And look, I think this is, I think it's better quality than the other one because, because it is Helix. Um, I'm gonna check which ink cartridge I put in this one. Is it a blue one or is it a black one? I can't really remember. This one's a black one as well. But still, I really like both of them. I got this ink pack for three pound, and there's fifty in them. I've used like two, or I'm using two. I've ordered one another fountain pens from Amazon because I really like these for some reason. I don't know why, but okay, let's write down let's write down hello and I'll show you the quality. First thing is compared to the green one, it's like way more smoother. Like that, and then you got this one. They're both smooth, but like look, you can hear the scribble on this one if you like do really quietly. I think you guys might have heard that. And then, now this is the Helix one, and look, you, I don't think you'll hear anything, look. And you can still hear it, but it's way, 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 way smoother and less louder. Look at this. Like, compare this to this. Mm. Yeah. Also, this one is plastic. It's from Bic. It costs... A pound fifty, so it is cheaper. But I do really, really like how you open it to take the encourage out. I'll show you. You have to do that, and you can take it out and change it, which I really like. The mechanism on that. <coughs> so this is overall really, really good. It is way better quality compared to this like i'll show you guys the nibs if they focus okay so this is i'm gonna try and make it focus but okay yeah now look at this nib i don't think you guys see a difference but to be honest the helix one looks way 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 shinier and stuff if, if it focuses like, and if you feel it, it just, like, this one feels like a plasticky metal. This feels like a metal. It feels like metal, but, like, really cheap one. Like a plastic one. And then this. So, yeah, so overall, I uh, like the Helix one better. It was... It did cost more than the big easy click pen and pen. It's like, yeah, the green one's called the big easy click. So, yeah. It comes in a better packaging than, like, the big one. This one's really simple. You just tear open and that's it. This one comes in a more fancy. But, like, you have that. It's, like, in there. I'll show you. Let me repack it. I'll show you guys. Well, the lid isn't on. Do that. Oh, the lid's on here. 
over here. And then that, that's like clipped onto here. Just like that. And then all you have to do is turn it around. Just turn it around again for some oopsie daisies. Yep, that's how it is packaged and inside of this box. So this one has like way more better quality. I can feel it. It's nice. Uh, the green one's more of a, like a really, really, really beginner version, for, like kids and stuff. I'm just a kid myself, but like like a beginner version. It's not got any. It's not that fancy compared to the Helix one. But yeah, about that. I don't have the packaging, but it's basically the same as the cardboard packaging, like the, the same as the, you know, the what the pens with the four clickers and the different colours, like red, green and blue, and that. Yeah, so, I'm going to wrap up here, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.